Welcome to my annual and final college move-in vlog. If you've been here since my freshman year, I have so, so much love for you. And if you're new here, I'm so grateful you found me and I really hope you stick around. For the newbies out there, my name's Lexi. I am a senior at Lehigh University, double majoring in cognitive science and journalism. And I got some sporadic footage, so I thought I'd just do a voiceover for this intro. So I flew into ABE, which is the Allentown Bethlehem Airport, from Atlanta, which is where I'm from, and I got straight to unpacking. As you guys know, I lived in my very first apartment last year with three roommates, but this year is extra special because I'm living alone in my very own studio apartment. I feel like that's enough info for the time being, so enjoy the vlog. Kitchen is clean, and my mom helped me hand wash a bunch of stuff, which was super helpful, and um, I put so much stuff, you guys, in my dishwasher, and I'm gonna run it tonight, so like all of my plates and glasses and everything like that, so I'm just like making sure there's nothing else to put in there before I run that for the evening, and then in the morning, I'll wake up and unload it, and then I'll have all my dishes set and ready to go, but we cleared out so many boxes which is super exciting tomorrow is definitely going to be a very heavy decorating day so that's always super fun but my mom did an amazing job um with my bathroom and like my bathroom it's not fully decorated but it's like set up and it's usable now so i'm going to show you guys that bathroom is here my mom picked out these beautiful rugs that are so plush and nice i definitely wanted like a neutral vibe in here but i'm definitely gonna still have my like little pops of pink and colorful vibes i got this matte black and bamboo let me save the details for the apartment tour like what am i doing i always do this and the matte black hooks so it's like super nice and definitely super usable now i'm covering this because it has my address on it it's a pr package that i'm super excited i like half opened it because i was in the midst of like trying to figure out what all the packages were um but super excited to open this and i got a couple of new things um i packed that bath and body works hand wash which is amazing and i love my nivea body cream body butter body cream whatever and i'm obsessed with this bosha face wash there are two bosha face washes that i'm obsessed with i ended up leaving this yellow one at home and then when we just ran into tj maxx a few hours ago i saw it and i was just like i have to get it like it has to be mine i need to have it here in pennsylvania but i like to use this one in the morning and then there's another one that i newly tried that i really like to use at night and i'll show you guys that at some point in this vlog i have had these since my freshman year and my mom's obsessed with them and i kind of don't want them in the bathroom i kind of just want to use them as planters but we're gonna see what i end up doing with them but my mom just like couldn't resist putting them here and here's me looking crusty i'm so tired you guys also like my hair is so flat from like being on the plane the humidity here and i hope that tomorrow is a better hair day super excited to continue like getting the like tedious obnoxious stuff out of the way so we can decorate. Decorating is gonna be so fun. A little sneak peek into my matcha slash coffee corner. Um, I got these adorable little like canisters. <laughs> and um, I'm gonna use this bigger one. I got one like smaller one and one bigger one. And I'm gonna use this bigger one for my Splenda. You guys know I'm a Splenda gal. It's gonna be absolutely fantastic and super functional. Oh. I just spilled. And that's all we're gonna do for tonight with the split. Putting on some of my jewelry right now. But major, major updates. We got so much stuff done last night and also today. We are about to run to the storage place. We have not eaten today, you guys, okay? It's almost two o'clock. It probably is past two o'clock and we have not eaten. So we're running on fumes, okay? But so many updates, let me show you guys. Okay, I got my desk set up, my bed set up, got my mirror hung and also my shell for my pictures to be on, nightstand. Living room is still a work in progress, but we're doing so good, you guys. Kitchen is like all clean and everything, just some miscellaneous things hanging around. Oh, my mom got a parking ticket for the rental car today <laughs> because we didn't wake up early enough to move the car. And we also have the console table up. Still a work in progress. I need to get a lampshade. And I got this beautiful mirror from Target that I was so excited about. Got such a good deal on it. That's like huge. It's a really big round mirror that's really going to open up this space. But you guys, it arrived broken. Like literally my whole 
um, foyer like entryway was filled with glass because it was all broken but that's the update for now and um, the bathroom I think I showed you guys the bathroom last night so yeah that's the update for now and we're about to go run errands and you guys are gonna come along so let's go They still have the bottles here at the Target Dollar section. These are the bottles that I put my syrup in, so come get them while you can. The last time I was here, this whole Target was under construction and I couldn't find anything. And now it's like all redone and it's so nice. Wow. I need a ton of pillows, so I'm gonna get these like Target ones. I think I'm gonna get maybe, should I get four or six? Cause I have a lot of um, pillowcases. Okay, there we go. You guys, so these pillows are literally so cheap. Oh wait, it might be six dollars because it's pink. Oh wait, these are pink too. Take a picture, just like we did. Yeah, I'm gonna take a picture to show them up front in case it rings up crazy. Made it back from where did we go? Target. Target's the only. Place. Oh, Target and Aldi. Got really good stuff at Target. So you guys know I got four of these pillows. You guys, these pillows were so cheap on clearance and they're so cute. So I got two of the white ones, which I'm gonna put in my baskets over there. That was my mom's idea. It was a really good idea. And then I also got this pillow, which this looks like something from like Urban or like Urban Outfitters or Anthropology. And it was like $6, I think. And I was like, oh, M G live laugh love love that so much and then I got the same white pillow the first one but I got it in pink just because like I want a lot of pillows on my bed I just want a lot of pillows on my bed like throw pillows just lots of different textures and everything and I got this one as well and it's like this pink and it has this really nice texture I love it. I got some Nature's Own bread, which is delicious, my favorite bread. And I got this mouthwash. I typically get the really, really big one, but I got this smaller size because I just don't really need a really, really big one. And also, um, I'm working with limited space now that I'm in a studio. I also got my favorite lemonade ever, which is the Simply Light. It was on sale two for five, so I got this for $2. And then I love these little tacos for my Cajun shrimp tacos that i like to make so these are really good and they're whole wheat like they're whole wheat flour tortillas i know corn tortillas is like the authentic tortilla that i should be using but i personally like i love a good authentic taco but i just love a flour tortilla and if it's whole wheat even better and then i got some pizza sauce and later i'm gonna do my little aldi haul and i'm gonna show you guys what i got because i saw this girl on tiktok making these like little pizzas such a quick and easy dinner and i found these really cute flatbreads at aldi and i got some pizza sauce because i'm gonna you know make my little pizza that i saw on tiktok so yeah um what else did i get oh got a couple more bags i got a red onion and a white onion from target because at aldi they only have like these huge bags and i don't need those huge bags got this salt and pepper shaker got one for my mom because my mom had these at home and i messed it up i basically like was cleaning it and then i flooded it with water so got my mom a new one and i also got one for myself and then I got a couple of seasonings that I was running low on. I love the Montreal chicken seasoning for my chicken, obviously, and the Montreal steak. But they have the Montreal spicy steak seasoning. So I'm going to be trying this. I like a little spice and I love the Montreal regular steak seasoning. So I feel like I'm going to like this one. And then I got like a golly, like he rang this stuff up like just in such a weird order i got some turkey pepperoni for my pizza and i also got this cilantro lime rice which i love every time i make it and anybody tries it they're like oh my gosh it's so good and it's literally just already made just put some water in it well not exactly but the instructions are on the back but it's just like already seasoned up for you next i got some toothpaste because i forgot to pack toothpaste and then i have some 
cotton swab slash q-tips and some cotton pads and i can't wait to just like get everything organized and stuff and make it like more functional in my bathroom especially got some deodorant this is the secret invigorating citrus one and it smells really good sometimes when i use deodorant i have to like switch my deodorants up i want to say like once every three or four months because it's like my body gets immune to the deodorant and i have to like switch to a different scent or like a different brand or a different strength if that makes any sense and then i also got some smuckers look at how cute this is i love like the little size like this it's just perfect perfect for solo living i'm gonna be saying that a lot you guys because i'm solo living it was so cute and um this is one of my favorite brands i was gonna try the good and gather one but the good and gather which is supposed to be like the generic cheaper brand was more expensive than the smuckers which is like the name brand so i went ahead and got all reliable miss smuckers that is not the end of the haul wait a second i got some lori's seasoned salt because i was running low and also the bread i was telling you guys about this is my favorite bread it's really good and it's low calorie put on a sweatshirt because i got a little chilly this is the aldi haul so took some things out of the bag to show you guys already got some asparagus i love skinny asparagus my mom doesn't and so now that i will be cooking for myself again i got some skinny asparagus a dream come true got some romaine lettuce i also got these bell peppers because i want to do these like stuffed bell peppers for dinner one day soon and i got my favorite cherries in the universe these are rainier cherries i call them rainies and they're so so good think of a mixture between like a gala apple and a cherry it's like that so good and then i also got some peaches and ironically i'm from georgia which is the peach state and these peaches were like a quarter of the price of the ones that i got in georgia and they look so so good so super excited about those also got some blueberries i'm trying to get into like chia seed pudding just because i need more fiber in my diet and i really have been wanting to try it so i'm gonna top my chia seed pudding with blueberries and peaches with some honey i feel like that would be so good got some tomatoes or tomatoes i got beef steak tomatoes because beef steak tomatoes are my favorite i got some brussels sprouts i got some tofu because there's this like air fryer tofu recipe that i really want to try out I did get some celery because um, I want my mom to help me make some chicken salad before she leaves out of town. These are the little flatbreads I was telling you guys about. So good. Got some carrots. This is my favorite trail mix ever. I don't like raisins, um, but this trail mix has dried cherries in it. And so, so good. It's from Aldi. I highly recommend. Got some avocados. Got some Colby Jack cheese. Colby Jack is my favorite to like eat in cubes. I just love it so much. Unsweetened vanilla almond milk is a must got a kombucha that i'll probably have in the morning because i still have yet to get some matcha and lastly mozzarella cheese for my little mini pizzas that i'm gonna make so that's the aldi haul i'm gonna put all of this away and relax for a little bit and i'll update you guys later I am basically just like going through, we're pretty much done going through my boxes and just like donating all this stuff. I was just very overwhelmed with like a lot of the clothes that I had because I had just so many clothes, but I have sorted through pretty much everything. My goal was to only have two suitcases full of clothes that I brought here for like the warmer weather seasons and then to be able to fit all of my winter fall clothes in sort of like a basket. Um, or like in these little bags from Ikea and only have max five or six not including shoes So I'm doing really good and now we're just putting things into the thread up thingies and yeah, that's the update There's a little kitty, not little My mom's really scared of cats so I'm like trying to shoo it away Go away! Don't scare my mommy. Don't look like it wants to be messed with. Hey guys, so my mom was just like, be careful, is that blood? No, it's definitely not blood, but well, hopefully it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not. She was just telling me bad people that are like, sometimes they use like storage places as like a dump site. And I was like, not that I would do that, but that's like, I mean, that's really smart, you know? Yeah, people would be fucking, yeah, people That's get horrible, them. it's like a normal Like the thing. high bodies and stuff like that, they put them in freezers and all kinds of crazy quarry stuff. 
I mean, I'm just speaking what I know. I mean, I'm, you see it on television. You've you see seen. It all the time. ID channel, all that kind of crazy crap. Criminal mind. And what about that one, that channel that the wives doing all the crazy stuff? What are you talking about? I don't know nothing about that. You know they kill the exes and all that. You know, just the crazy stuff. Just crazy stuff. stuff. So, y'all be careful around here with these storage units. Hopefully I didn't give anybody any ideas. Oh my God, he's back. The, the, the <laughs> I'm getting masculine energy, so I'm gonna say he. Actually, since we don't know, we're gonna say they. They're just chilling. I'm not much of a cat person. Like I don't think I'll ever have a cat. But that's a cute cat, and it's just looking at me like, oh wait, we should take a we should take a picture of it and send it to Paul. Thanks for making an appearance, your cameo. Okay, we made it to the post office. Gonna unload this stuff and send it off to Thread Up. We were able to ship off one of the boxes to Thread Up but our printing label did not print out the way that it was supposed to. So we're getting our good pal at the storage place to print it out for us. And yeah, this was all full. I had two of those pallets and a rolly cart. This was all full of all my stuff and I've gotten rid of so much of it that I don't even need storage anymore. So yeah. Back at uh, the post office, we got our printing or shipping label printed off and we can finally just drop it off. So yay. Look at how pretty the sunset is behind me. We just tried out this homemade ice cream place. And like when I, oh you got your pistachios on my cup. So good you guys. I'm gonna tell you what flavors we got once I get in the car. I got my mom's pistachio on my cup a little bit. Mm. Oh the pistachio is really good. It's really pistachio-y. This is a single. This is a double. Oh his ice cream cone was a single. Yeah. So I got black raspberry and um, graham cookie blast. And it's like the black raspberry, it's really good. It's a little tart, which I like. And I'm happy to put the graham cookie at the bottom because that's the one I'm gonna finish with. And my mom got pistachio. And what else did you get? Peanut butter cookie cup. I saw Iggy's, you guys. Like the Iggy, the dog breed. And I've never seen an Iggy in person. I've only ever seen them online. Like Iggy's are the dogs that Julian and Jenna Marbles have. And they were parked in a Tesla right next to us. And I asked the owner, I was like, are those Iggy's? And then they were like, yeah, they are. Nobody ever knows oh, what they no. are. Okay, so we did a lot of shopping today. I feel like in every one of my move-in vlogs, I've worn this sweatshirt. <laughs> yeah, you did you know? since freshman year, right? Since like freshman year, I think. We got some ice cream, we got some good stuff, and we're gonna enjoy, drive back. Mm-hmm. Car is full. Mm-hmm. Everything's out of storage. You know what I just realized, you guys? Chia pet chia seeds. Is it are those the same chia seeds? Yeah. <gasps> okay, made it back to my apartment and I'm gonna do a quick haul for you guys before I put everything away. Okay, first things first, starting with my Trader Joe stuff. I got these beautiful, beautiful lilies. My mom actually was kind enough to buy them for me, even though I was gonna buy them for myself. Um, so she got me a little housewarming. Um, bouquet of flowers, which is nice and guys they smell so good and she made sure to get bulbs that haven't opened all the way up yet Just so like I can watch them bloom and like open up. So I thought that was really nice of her some potato chips Just a regular classic one I got some popcorn. This is just a Trader Joe's popcorn and it has olive oil and I love it so much A lot of people say that it doesn't taste like anything, but I personally like it a lot I got two sleeves of these crackers because you know for like dips and stuff and i got some face and body sunscreen because i've just needed a cheap good sunscreen i didn't want to spend a ton of money on one and i've heard good things about this one hopefully it's not too oily and doesn't make my skin too oily and like i don't want to look greasy but i'll keep you guys updated on how i feel about this i already have romaine as you guys know but i got some arugula to mix in with my romaine and also to help with breakfast and i just like the peppery taste of arugula mixed in with other greens and other things i got some parmesan cheese because you can just never go wrong with having parmesan cheese around i got some lunch meat so i got some oven roasted chicory i got some slow cooked uncured ham i got some monster cheese and i also got some smoked turkey breast and i got these spinach little tortellinis which i feel like are going to be so so good with like some chicken and a little tomato sauce which i already have i could not pass this up it is this ranch seasoning blend i saw this somewhere but i'm going to mix this ranch seasoning blend in with some plain greek yogurt which i also got from trader joe's and make like a little like low ingredient 
um, ranch dip and I feel like it's gonna be super super good next up I got these noodles which I think are gonna be really good if I'm just having a busy day and what I love about them is like they're full like this is a good serving size and it doesn't seem like it's filled up with just like a bunch of sodium it seems like it actually has like noodles in here which is making it heavy so love that I love oatmeal cookies I love like oatmeal-y cinnamon-y vanilla-y things and my mom found these Trader Joe's cranberry white chocolate oatmeal cookies and I don't really like raisins but I don't mind dried cranberries so these are gonna be perfect for me next up I got some garlic powder because I need to refill my little garlic powder thing because I am running low I got some whole grain Dijon mustard because I love this on sandwiches and things of that sort and I also got some minced garlic I also got some aioli garlic mustard sauce I feel like this is gonna be so good I'm so excited to try this is like right up my alley and then I also got some balsamic vinegar or as Emma would say balsamic vinegar and I got some um, general so stir fry sauce i like to like marinate my chicken in this or just if i'm doing like a little roasted vegetable or something drizzle some of that on there it's really really good and i'm super excited about this i love like homemade barbecue chicken pizzas and so you guys know i got those flatbreads from aldi yesterday i got this truffle flavored barbecue sauce from trader joe's and it looks so good so bomb so i'm gonna use this as like the tomato sauce on my barbecue chicken pizza it's obviously a big haul you guys because i'm you know filling up my apartment with food. So I'm starting from scratch pretty much, but I got some honey. This is my first time ever buying almond butter. It was definitely very pricey, but I'm excited to try it. So we'll definitely see how I feel about it. I'm going to definitely try it with my chia seeds. I finally got my chia seeds, y'all. I'm gonna make my chia seed pudding tonight. I got cute little containers for it and everything, so super excited about that. Next, I got these, which I think I'm gonna really like. They are called Fancy Cheese Crunchies, and it's this cheese and truffle flavor. So I think it's gonna be nice to just like, I like to have a little snack, a little savory snack when I'm watching a show, when I'm, you know, just hanging out, just like got a little craving. And I feel like that's gonna be perfect for this. And last bag, you guys, let's go through it really quick. I got these chicken gyozas. I love these gyozas. They're so, so great for dinner. If you're just like having a rough day, you just need to get something in your system. These are great for that, so highly recommend these. These are one of my, like, anytime I go to Trader Joe's, I get these. I don't think there's been one singular time I've gone to Trader Joe's and not bought those. I also love, love, love the Trader Joe's turkey bacon. I love a little bagel thin with avocado, scrambled eggs, and turkey bacon. So bomb. Also because, you know, I just had to get some smoked salmon. I just had to with like avocado toast with smoked salmon and like a runny egg on top so good ground turkey my mom has this great recipe for these ground turkey like patty like burger patties that we make and it's so good you guys it's like amazing for the dips i got my smoked salmon dip which i'm definitely gonna eat with those crackers i also got this roasted garlic hummus which i'm gonna definitely have with my carrots and also the crackers and then this i like to put on wraps it's their vegan kale cashew and basil pesto it's such a good pesto but it doesn't leave you like feeling greasy or heavy because it like it has oil in it but i feel like the kale like absorbs some of it so it makes it more hearty here are the plain greek yogurts i was talking about when i was saying that i was gonna mix it in with the ranch also got some vanilla mochi because you gotta have a little dessert around the house you know what i'm saying and then the last couple of things some japanese fried rice just to like make some protein and just eat some fried rice for dinner and last but not least i just got one single frozen fettuccine alfredo it's like great if you just have a, a rotisserie chicken around and you know just like roast a veggie with that so super easy meal and i'm really happy with my trader joe's haul honestly i'm gonna be really good with grocery shopping for a while i need to be because this was not cheap but i'm gonna show you guys the rest of the things once i put these groceries away from TJ Maxx. I got these pillows um, $29.99 for two. They're memory foam. So I thought that was a great price for memory foam pillows. Also, I accidentally donated these because I had these in my last apartment last year 
and these were my favorite pillows ever and this was like the only one i've seen and next for target i got this little colander y'all know i hate plastic but you gotta have a little plastic bowl you know to store some food i also got another one of these pink pillows that i'm gonna put on my bed two look so much better so much more sophisticated love that these bowls they have lids so i got two of those bowls so i have two of those lids next i got these dish towels i like the color i know they're white which is probably kind of dumb to get but i'm gonna do my best to keep them clean i just like love a white dish towel i think it looks really nice last but definitely not least my little chia seed pudding cups they're glass and they have these little pink tops and i thought it was so cute like a set of four for ten bucks can't beat that oh also got my laundry basket from target definitely needed a laundry basket this one was only six bucks and it's definitely gonna do what it needs to do so yeah we went into like another tj maxx in home goods and i got this bad habit repair mode serum just because i needed like a nighttime serum and this one is good for night time i mean it says that on the packaging got a sponge holder to you know stick on my sink on the inside of my sink 4.99 i needed this fruit bowl so i got this my mom found it for me and it was 12 bucks super excited like how it has the pedestal to like you know add a little variation in height to my things on my counter from lowe's i got this long coaxial coaxial coat whatever tv cable i don't know whose idea it was to put the cable all the way on the other side of the apartment which makes no sense for the tv to be on but i had to get a really long one and then i got these nails to hang up my pictures i got two sets of these glass bamboo canisters i already have some that i got on amazon but these were eight dollars a piece so i got this size and then i got some like taller ones so i'm gonna put like my dried stuff in here so like my chia seeds my rice things like that that i just don't need in bags like taking up unnecessary space in my cabinet and then they can look like really cute and pretty too right now i'm in my bathroom and i'm organizing all of my things um like my bathroom stuff so i got those clear like acrylic containers from that setups too from tj maxx and i put my like cosmetics and then like one is for hair stuff and one is for pretty much other stuff and i also got this one i got this one to use for eggs but instead i'm going to use it for all of my skincare so just putting that in here right now Okay, I wrapped up with my bathroom for now and I wanted to build this lamp or not build it but put it together that Sun Marie got me and sent to me so I want to thank Sun Marie for sending me this lamp and I only saw it online obviously but I am going to put it together and I'm super excited because it's like the perfect lamp so I'm going to put this together right now we're going to do a little time lapse and then we're going to see how the lamp is looking so it looks like that picture and I picked it out because it doesn't take up a lot of floor space and it also has a little arc. So I think it's going to be nice. Let's build it. It literally took me, I think, six and a half minutes to build this whole thing. It was super super easy and the instructions were really easy too not a lot of words on the instructions which i like lots of pictures which i prefer when i'm putting something together okay we're about to plug her in oh yeah okay okay wait okay so it has like cool setting and then if you want it to be warm you just keep turning it <gasps> that is so nice oh my gosh i love i'm gonna keep it warm because i like warm light and i love it i'm really happy with the lamp thank you sun marie i will link their website in the description box below for you guys to check out but here is my lamp love it Good morning, you guys. It is um, Saturday morning, and I just prepared or like added toppings to my chia seed pudding, and it looks it looks like it's gonna be good. I put peaches, blueberry, and honey on top just now. Let it sit overnight. So 
here I go. I've got my cute little spoon, my cute little gold spoon here that I'm gonna try it with. Let's see. First impression, here we go. Oh, I love it. It's bomb. Yeah. I love it a lot. So this one I put coconut milk. Oh my gosh, wait. I kind of like really love the texture too. And that's what's weird because like I'm really weird when it comes to textures. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Wow, I feel like Ina Garten in my little linen shirt in my kitchen, chefing it up. Basically, I put coconut milk and sweetener in this one, in the two that I have prepared already. But I'm super excited to try it with almond milk, almond butter, and cinnamon. I feel like that would be really good with a little bit of like vanilla um, extract or something like that. I feel like that would be so good. Mm, I love it, I love it. I, I, I love it. But other than that, doing great. Everything's going very well. And I'm going to take a little day trip to New York today, which is super exciting. I'm taking it with my mom. So I am actually going to pause this vlog here and start another one for like my day trip to New York. And then I will come back and like wrap up this moving vlog. So yeah, that's what's going on. I will talk to you guys later. I'm gonna finish my chia seed pudding and do a little bit of makeup get cute, get ready. And yeah. It is Sunday and had a really, really fun trip in New York yesterday. I'm back home, obviously, and all home. And right now I am about to film an Ikea haul. So make sure you guys check out that video. It'll definitely be up after this one. But basically I'm doing like a little Ikea shop with me. I'm coming back and doing a haul, which I'm about to film right now. And then the things that I am including in the haul, I'm going to set up in my apartment. So it's also going to be like a decorate with me video. So that's super fun. So definitely keep that in mind and keep a lookout for that video. So I'm going to film this really quick, this haul portion of that video. And this then I am going to run my like last few errands before I start my job tomorrow. Yes, self-employed, but I'm also now working for the man. But my boss is a woman, so a woman. So, yep, she's a low-key a nine-to-five girly. Well, like for the next week, and then I pretty sure I get to choose my hours after that but super exciting and I will talk to you guys once I'm done filming this haul back at it on my chia seed pudding grind I put some almond butter in here honey and cinnamon ooh 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 delicious delicious we're in a shopping center with a bunch of errands that we have to run right now so that's very exciting mom how are you feeling let's I, you haven't really talked much and in all my moving vlog you know you have your little moment so oh i'm feeling great how do you feel about my new place oh i love it i love it love it love it that, that makes so me cute. happy that makes me so happy yep. i'm very happy that we accomplished a lot in a short amount of time and yeah i'm me really too. happy that you're going to be comfortable and i'm um, leaving you to enjoy yes fun seeing you grow amazing so made it back these are the two mirrors that i got from ikea yesterday and might end up hanging them tonight but we're gonna see just gonna put this stuff away hang these mirrors maybe but definitely hang these pictures tonight i think and just like decorate and stuff so yeah It is several days later. I just got off of my third official day at my new job and I got my dining table delivered. It got delivered late, but we're gonna open it and put it together right now. And I'm super excited because I haven't had a place to eat, which I didn't realize how much and how important that is. So um, yeah, we're gonna put it together and I'm hoping that it looks good and that it's not too big and not too small. All right, here it is. And I say we just go ahead and jump right into it. Oh, also, I forgot to mention that my mom is gone and um, yeah. 
so I've been spending the last few days in my apartment alone and it has been really nice. I think I'm like really making myself at home and everything. Got some more mirrors hung in my apartment and it just makes the apartment look so much bigger. Um, Still, my living room is a work in progress. I did get my rug for my living room delivered or like my living room area, I should say. And um, got some baskets for my little media console table. So still getting this all figured out. But as for like my foyer and stuff, I definitely don't have a lot of lights on right now so sorry about that but my foyer table is doing good love that bathrooms all set up and i also got this mirror from ikea which definitely like really opens up this hallway section that i have here and as you guys saw in one of the last clips i did hang these pictures up and it just definitely adds some color into my little entryway which i love day i finally got my mirror for my entryway this is my third time ordering it and it's come completely broken twice it's been delivered broken twice so hopefully this time it's not broken so far so good and it came in one piece third time was the charm the mirror is hung look at that wow gorgeous gorgeous girl I'm so excited, I love it so much. I set up my dining table last night, as you guys saw, and I'm absolutely in love with it. Perfect, especially with the chairs that I have to go with it, and it just made me so excited to do an apartment tour once I get fully settled and get everything in. Um, but I did eat my dinner at my dining table last night, and I almost had breakfast at it this morning, and it was just really, really nice. Great addition to have. Um, I did get a package that I'm super excited about so I figured I would open it for you guys on camera So hang tight for a second while I grab that got this package from Pura And if you guys are not familiar with Pura, they are this like smart device for fragrancing your home or your living space and I am super, super excited to use these things and just also share with you guys what Pura is. Okay, so I'm opening up the packaging and I got two of their fragrances and they are doing a collaboration with Nest right now, Nest New York. And I got the Sicilian Tangerine and Grapefruit Fragrance Refills and I've already smelled these in person and they smell so, so great. These are two of my favorite scents right now. So I'm super duper we're excited oh it looks like they also included two more of these scents which is also very exciting so as well as the Sicilian tangerine and grapefruit i also got the amalfi lemon and mint and also the ocean mist and sea salt all of nest fragrances are great so i'm super excited about these and i'm also just like super excited to like hook up my pure as you guys can see it's like a really sleek design and oh my gosh, this is <laughs> like so fun. I decided to get some footage of me setting up my Pura. The setup process was super, super simple and easy and I'm in love with this product, you guys. I cannot believe that something like this exists. It's like so futuristic and it genuinely works. It also has a night light that you can set and you can change the color of the night light on your phone. It also has like a schedule for when you want the night light to come on and when you want your scent to be diffused. It also has intensity set settings overall it's just freaking amazing and i highly recommend i will link pure site in the description box and also have a discount code for you guys if you guys are interested in getting a pure which i would highly recommend i wanted to come on here really quickly to in this vlog um like i said in the beginning of this video this is my fourth and final college move and vlog so i really hope that you guys enjoyed it and loved it I loved making it. This time really did fly by and I could get all sappy and emotional and everything, but I'm not going to do that. I just do want to say that my senior year I am so excited for and 
it's going to be and feel a lot different for me in the most positive way and I know I'm saying that before I even start. I start my first day of classes tomorrow so there will be a last first week of college vlog um, on my channel but um, I just want to thank you guys so much for your love and your support. Sorry for the background noise. My washer and dryer going right now. Um, I do have another video going up later today. It's a Sunday reset vlog and also an apartment update. I was going to upload this vlog yesterday which was Saturday but it just felt more like a Sunday upload you know so two videos in one day please watch them both if you have the time and yeah happy to be here um so grateful to have you guys on this journey with me and supporting me and all of your positive energy and everything I am gonna go ahead and sign off but before I go I want to remind you guys to spread kindness and always remember that the less you wander the more you wonder I love you guys so so much and I will see you in my next video bye guys yeah, I wanna try myself inside the jewel